Oh. I love birds. It's quite tasty. Here it goes down into my belly. The human torch was denied a bank loan. How long till we're on? Um, actually, I, the, the red light's on. I believe that's what that means. I don't believe no, you. No, really. Good evening, Chicago, and welcome to US 99.5. All Access. I'm Marcy Corningstone. And I'm Joe Burgundy. This week on All Access Eyewitness News, Jack Ingram is going to stop by. Right now, Mr. Burgundy has some news about Chicagoland sports. The U.S. 99.5 softball team coming off a huge win over the mix last week had a huge game against ABC TV. Here with sports today is Dominic Fantana. Thanks, Joe. The U.S. 99 softball team moved to 2-0 this week after last week defeating the mix in a real barn burner 15-14. They beat down ABC Television this week 18-2. The attack was led by a powerful offense which scored seven runs in the first inning without recording an out before the umpire had to invoke the mercy rule. No good in softball. They also showed their defensive prowess by not allowing a hit until the fourth inning. That is unheard of in the softball leagues. No steroids in me Joe Epperson singles to pad his RBI total of the year takes it all the way to four. Lisa Mitchell from Traffic gets the team out of a jam by singling the center. John Charleston, account executive, legs out a double. And then Larry the Ringer clears the bases with a three-run shot to left. That wouldn't have been a home run in a silo. Stellar defense. The whiff, choking on a splinter. She gone, grab some bench. The stats add up, and 18 runs later, US 99 prevails to move to 2-0. Sportsmanship and a good time was had by all. Here's what the coach had to say. It was a great game. We're going to give the game ball to Lisa Mitchell. Yay! Way to go, Lisa. Yeah, give it back. Give it back. <laughs> Congratulations on a, on a great week for you. She got, the, she got the ring that she wanted and well deserved. Yeah, congratulations. Plenty of good times to go around for this season. So next week, the team will try to improve to 3-0. Tuesday night against Q101. I got a tip they're going to beat him by 10. Back to you, Joe. Thanks, Dom. In other news, your winning lottery numbers for the evening of Wednesday, May 9th were as follows. The evening pick 3 was 375. The pick 4, 6313. I had 6314, unfortunately. Better luck next time. The Little Lotto, 18, 22, 27, 31, and 34. And the lottery was 7, 9, 32, 40, 43, and 47. Now with entertainment, Marcy Corningstone. This week, Jack Ingram, Mr. Hottie out of Texas, stopped by to co-host with Lisa Dent. Roll it. Rawr! <laughs> Roll it. Barbara just called too. She was all excited because apparently you were in the Palm celebrating your win at the CMT Music Awards. Which, by the way, congratulations. I told you when you were in here you would score that award. I can't. I still can't believe you won that award. That was, that was great fun. You should have brought the big old belt buckle in here. Well, they haven't said this is the fun. They haven't sent it to me yet, so I'm not sure. Maybe they're having like a revote, a recount <laughs> or something. <laughs> but uh, yeah, that was really cool. Hi, I just want to make a face of you and Jack Ingram. Only if it's something nice. <laughs> it is something nice. <laughs> I just wanted to tell him that he did an amazing job last night, and whatever he's running on this morning, I'd like him to tell me because I was at the concert. It took us four hours to get home. We'd get home till three thirty, and I had to get up and go to school this morning and work. I'm like dying. Yeah. Well, so am I. Running on running on Red Bull and. Starbucks. Adrenaline. <laughs> Starbucks. And Lisa Power. Is it greasy? I think so. Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's greasy. <laughs> that's your evening news. I'm Marcy Corningstone. Thanks for stopping by, Chicago. And I'm Joe Burgundy. You stay classy, Chicago. But mostly, thanks for stopping by. Hey, mostly stay classy. No, no. Stay classy. No, definitely stay classy. By. You have bad hair. That, that's it. I can't work with this woman. <laughs>